So one half of the championship set would it be an all Northwest Ohio matchup on Saturday morning. It would be if Hicksville could get the victory, making their fourth state appearance, but they haven't won the title since 1978. The Aces taking the field in the second game of the day, looking to punch their ticket to the finals on Saturday. Starting the bottom of the first, Hicksville down one. Jake Greer, the base hit, advancing his runner to third. Then Zach Brickle hits one into right field. That brings in the tying run. We're all knotted up at one apiece. More from the Aces. Braden Langham hits a line drive, and he beats the throw. That's another ace run. They're in front for the first time today. We head to the third. Lucas Yoder gets on base because of the high toss to first. Then it's Brickle again, blasting one off the right field wall. That brings in his runner with ease. It's three to one aces. More from Hicksville. Eric Chapman, the sack fly, puts them up four to one. Fourth inning now, Hicksville's Jonah Gipple knocks it. There, it's an error. He ends up on second base, but he would be stranded. We skip ahead to the sixth inning. Some Hicksville defense as Gage Yoder fields the grounder, flips it to the first baseman for the out. Yoder not letting anything by as he comes up with a third out on another ground ball. Top of the seventh, Hicksville still leading four to one. Greer forces a pop out for out number one. Then it's Greer with the strikeout. Hicksville just one out away from advancing to the finals. And Greer again, another K. That ends at his 13th strikeout of the day. Huge effort for him as Hicksville wins it four to one. Yeah, what do you, I mean, what do you say? I mean, when he, when he takes the mound, that's what I'm thinking I'm going to get from him every time. And, and today he had his stuff. He had him off balance the whole day. Uh, you can't ask for more. We have a little bit of information on him. We'll, uh, we're going to enjoy it right now. And then uh, tonight we'll, all the coaches will sit down and we'll uh, kind of come up with a game plan. And then we'll, we'll get that to Parker tomorrow. So we're gonna be, we'll, we'll get hand over to Parker Steele on Saturday. I know the defense had my back when that's a start, so I didn't have to worry about doing it all. I could just throw and uh, spot pitches and just see what happens. Um, I feel good. We got a uh, 1A, 1B pitching staff here, and I had confidence part two will uh, throw this game, and hopefully we can just swing it again. Well, it's just baseball. We've been taking it day by day, and, and uh, game by game, and we're just uh, so excited to be here right now. It's an opportunity to win state. And some jitters, we've been thinking about it. You know, not much. Just keep playing good ball for us, and I think we got this. We play good ball lately. Just continue to play good defense and everything else, and good pitching. I think it all come together.